Hi, and welcome to day 60 of the 100 day project. Today will be my 60th day of making collages. But before we go through that, as uh, some of you have been following the videos, that every 20 days I go back. And today I'm going to go back from the beginning so we can refresh. Just to show you, this book has 80 pages and we're on day 60. So I don't know how if I'm ever going to be able to close it. But let's start at the beginning. And I'm just going to quickly flip through the pages just to give a review and a glimpse of how things were and what we did for 60 days. And it's been quite an adventure. Trying to keep things different each day, um, using different materials, textures, papers, um, trying to make each page unique in its own space. Hope you're looking at these and figuring out what your favorites are. I haven't figured mine out yet, so I'm gonna wait and hold off till the next the next 40. And that's all we will have left. Ah, there was Bert Maisie's. And today is my little Shusha's birthday. She's got she's four years old. She's another Katonda Talur. So she's four years old today. So this is a busy day. Um, being 60 days in, Maisie's birthday was this month, Shusha's birthday is today, got some tags in some of these, funny how fast 60 days goes when you're flipping through it, and here we come to the, our day 60, and what I did, I got, guess what I got in the mail yesterday, I got the new Tim Holtz Stampers Anonymous. Uh, this is the Creative Blocks. They're brand new. And what I did was, now you know I'm going to be uh, cutting these up. So I stamped some of them and then I used his Distress Watercolor Pencils. So I'm going to cut that. I usually don't cut in front of you, but I wanted to show you um, the new stamps. And we're going to arrange them in blocks. So I don't think we'll be using all of them. So of course I'll have stash for later. So that'll be cool. And you know how crazy and non-measuring I am. So, and then I thought we would throw in some really fun, uh, maybe add some postage stamps to this little collage and we'll see what happens. But I thought these would be great to make some colorful blocks and um, to see where it would take us. I know you're not used to me starting from almost scratch. Well, almost scratch. Not really. I got the stamps made and just plugging them into where we would go. Love those Distress watercolor pencils. I usually just dip them in water and put a water brush to the pencil and just apply to the paper with the water brush. So I'm cutting them all up because I don't know which ones I'm gonna use. And this gives me an opportunity to arrange I don't even know which direction. I have to look and see which is the right direction on some of these. Because I just ripped them open and started stamping. And I thought, this would be a great day 60. So. Okay, and. Here, let's do that there. Okay, so I've got all the stamps made, and you know it's going to be a quick, quick 
could see what we could do here. So I'm gonna grab one. So happy they came. Also got a few more stamps um, from the set and of course the stencils. So the stencils will be nice for part two of this. Like in no, these are gonna be used and more and layered even more um when the hundred days is up so and i noticed there was also a um five minute uh, special going on and you can tell that girls i've got the door open because it's such a beautiful day they're, I think they're trying to celebrate Shusha's birthday a little with some noise. Here's hoping that they um uh, there's quail out there. I don't know if you can hear them or not. But there's some quail. I've got some rabbits outside. Um, once in a while, we see coyotes, so, um, yeah. Let me get our share here. I almost had a, lo a, li a giant lizard walk in the house the other day. It scared Shusha terribly. They were going a little crazy. Maisie, 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 easy, come on, I'm working here, and it's not even time for the mailman to show up yet, so that's interesting, right there. they're going about their business like that. Piper, stop, Piper. What I love about these, as I'm looking at them, is they could be going any way. I don't know if he, if Tim made them, that you could just arrange some of these any way, but it's really nice that we have that option. And one more. so fun it's so nice i wanted to feature these because we had them today and i don't know after that my thought process i was thinking about adding some really 
some postage stamps, some real postage stamps. Let's see if I can't. That's such bad luck. are real stamps. I know you've seen some where I have some fake ones. Don't tell anybody. Let's see if I can't. If I don't put these back, they'll be all over the place. That's not a stamp. I can already see what I'm going to be doing in the future with this one. That's what's so nice about doing these and claiming that they're backgrounds to start and then to finish them off. I'm good. Let's see here. I think um, this will be an excellent background for the future. And I'm really liking that those new stamps from Tim. And they will, you'll be seeing those a lot in the future from me. So here's my collage for day 60 of the 100 day project. Thanks for watching and I will see you tomorrow.